going on everyone? Uh, so today, we're trying to get things done. I went and lifted earlier, so I have that out of the way. And right now, I'm really just kind of plugging away at my attack plan for my merchandise, uh, which is really, really exciting. That's happening. Yep, that is Jenna's underwear. You're a perv, Peach. You're a perv. Anyway, I am coming up with designs. I'm refining these designs. You guys who have sent me things on Twitter and art and certain things like that, I really appreciate it because some of it is actually inspiring me to use that and obviously, you know, make it my own and make it really cool art to put on a t-shirt. So right now I have two t-shirts that I'm planning on putting out. One is Let's Get Caffeinated and other is a Page t-shirt. So uh, I'm really excited about that because I've never had any shirt for myself. I've only worn like team shirts and shit like that. So it's pretty cool. And um, I think you guys are gonna like them. I'm gonna make them nice and comfortable to wear, not just like stiff cardboard shirts. We are uh, refraining from Xbox during the day right now so we can get shit done, but I wanted to update you with that stuff because I'm working on it and I know it's gonna be out soon and I'm really excited to show you guys. Also, I'm really excited because today's a little bit like Christmas for me because I'm getting today in the mail a box of stuff from my favorite brand like ever. It's called Virus International, Virus INTO. Uh, they make like tights and workout clothes and I just like, I love them so much because I, I've worn tights my whole athletic career and uh, I've never had any any as comfortable and as awesome as these because I wore them for weightlifting and training just in the gym or whatever they're just comfortable so that should be here today which I'm really fucking psyched about uh, hopefully that comes today so I can get all giddy and open my new clothes that is all for now as more happens throughout the day I'll keep you guys updated but I'm gonna let Peach continue her perverted underwear eating Peach that's disgusting you're a perv my goodies came Look at my shirt and my cool shorts. Oh yeah. Fucking jealous. Mad tights, yeah. <laughs> Jenna, Jenna loves virus because I got her some tights a while back. Yeah, I fucking love virus. Okay, virus's tights, like I'm, I'm telling you, they're the most comfortable mm -hmm. fucking. Julian would consider himself somewhat of a tight connoisseur. <laughs> <laughs> I like to say that, yeah. Man tight connoisseur. Man tight. I wore tights even when I was a kid. I just love tights. And like, I've worn Nike tights, every other kind of tights you could think of. And these are the most comfortable. Thank you, Virus. I love this stuff. Uh, so if you guys care about tights or looking like you belong in space when you're working out and really, really comfortable shit, you should check them out. I will link their website in the description. So you just click that if you wanna go look for their shit. But yes, this is like my Christmas. So Jenna is making an incredible looking thing that I wanted to document and share. So I might as well make it a little mini episode of J&J's. It's an enchilada bake, but it's vegan, it's gluten free. And right now she's got all of the ingredients prepped. We got frozen corn, onions, peppers, jalapeno, more peppers, that garlic, mixing bowl. And then over here, Jenna is preparing the quinoa which is gonna go inside of the bake. Yeah, I made mean, lazy quinoa. I usually toast it, but I wasn't gonna do all the extra. There's no such thing as lazy quinoa. I was just gonna throw it in a casserole pan. Is that your casserole pan dance? Casserole pan. So she's preparing the quinoa. This is gonna be crazy. And then she's over here, she's got black beans, she's got the enchilada sauce, and she's gonna bake it in a pan like this, uh, which is pretty dope. Oh, we need to cut the cilantro. Okay, we'll cut the cilantro. Oil, oil for the goyel. Yeah, by the way, this recipe is from a website. I found it on Pinterest, their website is twokeysandtheirpod.com. Aww. Isn't that cute? Ow. And you're gonna add jalapeno and the onion and garlic. And this is our lazy garlic. So what kind of oil is that? Olive. Oh, <laughs> oh, but you're hot. Oh, it's hot. We're gonna be adding all this here. It looks beautiful. Added the red and orange peppers and the corn, and it said I could use frozen corn, so I was like, okay. <laughs> it does look really good. Then it says we're gonna add some lime juice, cumin, chili powder, and cilantro. Now I'm gonna take our quinoa that you made and put it in that bowl of black beans. So then you're gonna take all the stuff and combine it into one magical fiesta. Fiesta. It looks like a fucking mouth fiesta. Looks like a mouth sex fiesta. <laughs> and a broke some goats. That's measuring. Thanks. I'm so good at the measuring. A teaspoon? Okay. Like that. That's so really good. Salt and pepper. Yeah, we probably don't need that much. Always more salt and pepper. Always. <laughs> good enchilada dance. Thanks. Okay, put it in there. Calm down, keep on. <laughs> 
looks like a fiesta. This looks fucking incredible. It smells bomb. It smells so good. Good man bun today, by the way. Thank you. You're welcome. Now we're gonna take our enchilada sauce. Oh my god, it's really nice. <laughs> yeah. Vlogging and cooking. Shut up, Sam. Wait, I gotta rinse my hand off. I a casualty. And casualty, my hand. Oh my gosh, this smells so good. Yes, but now, and secret ingredient is some cheese. <laughs> vegan cheese, though, you gotta say. I substituted the vegan cheese for the real cheese. Oh, it looks bomb. Smell it up, smell it up. <laughs> yeah, smell it up. Yeah, it's probably good. Hot enough. And then you mix some right, cheese mix in, in right? yeah. And then you sprinkle the rest on top. And then all that moisture is gonna bake out and it's just gonna be enchilada. So much moisture. It's really Sorry. <laughs> Stop moisture. creeping on my casserole. Like, so good. Yeah, it looks fucking bomb. Okay, so then we pour it on there. Yep, then you're gonna pour it into here. Yas, food, yas, yas. That's what I'm talking about. Yas, yas, enchilada, enchilada. Notice me senpai and gelato. <laughs> <Notice me enchilada. laughs> <laughs> now I'm gonna take the rest of the cheese and sprinkle it. You want the whole pack then? Yeah, because that's two cups, the yeah, whole thing. This is like a, like what, five Wait, I'm not gonna eat the whole thing. <laughs> yeah. You should. Because if you don't, Just I'm done. Eat the whole thing to your face. Bake for 20 minutes, then remove foil, and then bake for an additional 10. Good boy, y'all. Boy, y'all. Boy, y'all. Like the boy, y'all. Ooh! Bye, Angel on the bank. I'll see you soon. Damn, bro, that's some cooking right there. <laughs> and the final product. This is the most delicious. <laughs> it's so bomb. <laughs> so good. I'm about to eat more of it right now. Right now. Oh, the dog. But that that's, is the final product. It's really good. It wow. tastes a lot like the um, vegan chili. It tastes a lot like the vegan chili that I make, except the, the peppers and the corn and like that stuff make a really big difference. It's yeah. really bomb. And then gelato sauce is bomb. Yeah, it, it smells so good and it tastes just, how does it taste? <laughs> Yeah. Good tasting. Oh, such a good dog. Oh, oh. Hey, um, cherries. Good cherries. It was in uh, Pinterest, right? Yeah. Alright, I'll link the I'll link it for you guys so you can Pinterest it your fucking selves. <laughs> bye. Say bye to JJ's Kitchen. Bye. bye.